Hello, and welcome back to the show. My name's Christian, and this is the uh, Brave New Wear, the show. Uh, in the last month or so, I moved into this new beautiful apartment, as you can see, and um, I haven't posted anything I'm trying to get back on my feet. So, it's time for me to do the proverbial recent pickups. Now, uh, I don't typically, or I haven't even thought to do recent pickups because I can't really compete. And, um, I don't know. I try to create content. I try to make stuff that really makes you think. How did that hair get in my mouth? Nobody knows. But I did pick up a couple of things during the time when I was moving from my last apartment into this one. Um, and I'm going to show off some of them. The first is this Dior Ohm. It's like a rugby, it's a long sleeve polo that I'm wearing right now. It's got that Sig signature B. And it's got this kind of stripes collar. Um, it's kind of cool. I believe, I think these are both Eddie Salmon era pieces. And I have this other one. This is more of like a, it's like a collarless navy shirt. It, it's collarless kind of, and it has like a satin collar here, but the same B. This one fits a little boxier, like this fits in a way that you wouldn't tuck it in. This guy, the thing I have on right now, is kind of skinny, like a skinny fit. And I got these, I was basically gifted them, and I thought, they're dope, because they're Dior. A lot of things are happening with Dior, and I wish them the best of the block. Uh, piece number two on my hits list. This is a Sandro sweatshirt that I got from my work. Uh, I picked it up for maybe like $30, and there's not so much cool about it. It's not that sta like spectacular, but I could use like a crew neck sweatshirt, and it has this little like uh, bomber pocket that I thought was kind of a cool detail. And since I got it for so cheap, I'm like, $30, that's a pretty good deal. And it's navy. I like wearing a lot of navy monochrome stuff. And Sandro, I kind of think is a cool, it's a cool, it's a quasi-luxury. And it's like, kind of like a placeholder for what Saint Laurent was. At a time. Once upon a time. One of my fave pickups recently. Is this Acne Studios hat. Uh, I got this also for like $30. And they retail, I think sometimes they retail for like 200 and I was I could get it for 30 at my job, so I'm like, yeah, baby, hook me up. I always wear a lot of beanies in the winter time, and I like this guy because he's really chunky, he's really thick, and I'll show you how he fits. It fits, it's a fit only for the bold, because it's got a real tip to him. A little suggestive. Um, but it's like a big hat. Uh, but it's, I think it'll keep me nice and warm, and I love wearing beanies, and this guy is just kind of really, it's kind of luxurious, and they're pretty cool. I like this one. I had the choice between this guy and the black one, and I picked the gray just because it's a little different. But I think my favorite out of all of them, if I could choose from any color, I love the pink. That's my favorite of these hats. Last, and certainly not least, I got these uh, Easy Miyake. Um, what is it? It's Ome Plize of men's pleats, pants. These, I, I've seen a lot of people kind of rocking these, socking these, uh, and I'm like, man, I want some. Uh, so, I got these off of Grailed, and the fit, I will probably post something on my Instagram with the fit. It's not, it's like a wide fit, and this is a size 2, and it fits me, like it fits on my waist, but I think a size one might have been better. And I oh, might even sell these in search of a size one, as long as I can keep them in this pristine condition. But the fit is wide and beautiful. Of course. Um, and I'll post something. Other housekeeping, follow me on Instagram. I changed my Instagram handle from Brave New Air to my name, Christian Scavetta, uh, just because I don't know, I have some ideas. Maybe I'll do something else with the that title that reflects directly on this channel. But right now, I just like, if somebody asks me what my Instagram handle is, I'm like, my name.
Oh. I thought that was the camera turning off and it was the PS4 turning on. Which is my cue. <laughs> I've got Red Dead Redemption waiting for me. Thanks for tuning in. There'll be more videos to come about faction and the world of the arts. Because now I live in a beautiful decor department. All of my doing. All from my creation. And uh, nobody can take that away from me. <laughs> I'll see you later.